Magandang nga po sa iyong lahat. Ako si Bea Milian Windorski, proudly representing the USA. <laughs> Thank you. Um, I am a honors graduate from University of Wisconsin, and I have aspirations to one day work for the UN High Commissioner for Refugees. During my time as a volunteer tutor for immigrant and refugee students, I realized that an increasing share of these students weren't just fleeing armed conflict or political violence, they were actually also fleeing rising sea levels, intensified natural disasters, and prolonged droughts, which is why I advocate for a clean energy transition and the expansion of legal protections for climate displaced people. Good afternoon, USA. I am Daniela Mishpidlawan from SCL Club 2P, and my question for you is, how do you plan to build upon the legacy established by the reigning Miss Earth to further make an impact for our Mother Earth? Thank you, Paul, for that incredible question. I'm so proud to be a part of this legacy because Miss Earth is actually the only international pageant to be recognized by the United Nations. And I would build upon this legacy by not just creating opportunities for myself, by creating partnerships with nonprofits, NGOs, and international organizations like I have already done in the US, but I would also create opportunities for future Miss Earths. And regardless of if I clinch the crown or not, my commitment to environmentalism extends far past this pageant. It isn't just a trend, it's a lifestyle. Thank you so much. Hi, Bea. Let's get to know you more on a personal level. What negative self-talk do you deal with every day and what do you tell yourself to negate that? I am the proud daughter of a Filipina immigrant, um, but she kind of likes to call herself my mom, Tony Mian. She's an amazing influence, but she likes to call herself diet tiger mom. Like she's not a full blown tiger mom, but because of that, I've really raised myself to be a perfectionist, to be critical of my shortcomings, and I encourage people to embrace empathy, to be empathetic to other people who are in different situations. So I really need to teach myself and the world to be empathetic to yourself. Thank you for your beautiful message, Miss USA.